Hi friends, welcome to my channel Plotus Geek. In today's video, we are going to fix your driver error code 31. The device is not working properly in your Windows PC. So let's go ahead and proceed. The very first step is to open your settings menu, choose update and security and click on windows update. From here, if updates are available, make sure you choose the option download and install so that make sure that your windows is up to date. By updating windows, your drivers will be updated automatically and fix out your issue. If windows update doesn't work out, the second step is right click on this PC and click on the option manage. Choose the option device manager over here and in this right page, choose your problematic driver. The problem generally occurred with network adapter. So I'll give an example of the network adapter over here. You need to right click on the adapter which is giving you an error with yellow exclamatory sign. Choose the option properties. Choose the driver tab and click on update driver. Choose the second option browse my computer for driver. Now choose again second option let me pick from the list of available drivers. From here choose the driver and if more than one driver are available next to it the date of the driver will be provided. So make sure you choose the latest date. Click on the next button and close it and then restart your system. This will fix out your issue. Now if updating doesn't work out then simply means you need to make a rollback of your driver. So right click on the problematic driver and choose properties. Choose driver tab and click on the rollback driver. I haven't installed any new updates that's why the option is not available to rollback. But at your end if you have the latest drivers the option will be available in front of you. Choose the option rollback driver to rollback your driver to the last stable state. This will surely fix out your issue. Now if this also doesn't work out, the third one option is to let windows automatically install the drivers for you. So for that you need to right click on the problematic driver. For example here is the yellow exclamatory sign. I will go ahead and right click on it and choose the option uninstall device. Click on the uninstall option. Once the driver is uninstalled, close the driver and restart your system. Once your system restart, the driver for that particular driver, for that particular hardware will be installed automatically by your Windows 10. Now, if this also doesn't work out, the only option we are left with is using the registry editor. Click on the start menu and type run. Open the run command and type here. R E G E D I T and then hit the enter button. Now in this address bar, you need to paste a path. I'll provide this path in the description below. Hit the enter button. Now in this right pane, you will find the file with the name config. You need to right click on it and click on the delete button. Once deleted, go ahead and restart your system. By doing these four ways, your problem must be fully resolved. Now if all these options fail, the only option we are left with is to update the driver online because it is only the malfunctioning of the driver which is causing the error. Open Google Chrome and type here driver identifier dot com. Download a driver identifier in your system and then install it. Agree the terms and conditions. Once the driver identifier is installed, click on the option scan now. Make sure you must be connected to the internet while performing this action. Now here are the results of the identifier and these are drivers which I need to be updated. So whichever driver is causing you the error, you need to click on the update driver. For example, Intel SD graphics is the driver which is causing me the error. Click on the update button to download the driver in your system. 
scroll down and here are the Intel graphics for 64 bit Windows 10. Click on the download button. Scroll down and here is the download link. Here is the link from the official website which is Lenovo because my system or manufacturer is Lenovo. Save it in your desktop or wherever you want. Once this file is downloaded, here is the file which is downloaded. This is an application file which is your driver. You need to double click on it to run this application and then install it in your system just like you install any other software in your computer. It is taking a long time to download that's why I am not going to install but at your end once it is downloaded go ahead and install this file in your system. This will 100% fix out your issue.